Hi, and welcome to another tutorial for Excel users. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to reveal formulas on a spreadsheet. Now, if you're taking tests in school or at college, or even if you're at work and you're wondering what calculations lie behind the results on a spreadsheet, there's a very simple way you can uncover the formulas. One obvious way is to simply click on a particular cell. So if I click on any one of those income calculations, you can see there's a very simple multiplication. If I click on my total, you can see the, the sum calculation that leads to that result. But there are times when you want to see all the calculations, you might want to print out um, the formulas for a test, as I said, and just clicking on them one by one is a bit tedious. So to do that, there's a very simple keyboard shortcut. And what you do is, well, there's a key you need to identify, first of all. I refer to it as the spare key. You might know it as different names, I don't know. And typically, it sits between the tab key and the escape key on the left-hand side of the keyboard. It usually has three little symbols on it for different characters that you can enter. And what you do is you hold down the control key and then just tap that spare key. And as you can see on the screen there, it's revealed all the formulas on the spreadsheet. And that keyboard shortcut operates like a switch. So to undo that, I simply do the same thing again, control and spare and just keep doing that you'll see it's show formulas, hide formulas, simple as that. Once the formulas have been revealed you can then obviously print them out. If I now go say to print preview you'll see that the formatting isn't quite right but I can soon fix that by going to setup in this case an obvious thing to do would be go to landscape select fit to one page click OK and there you can see you can see all the formulas so I can print those out and use them for whatever purpose I need Okay, so I'm just going to close that, come out of print preview, and I'm going to do control and spare key again just to hide those formulas. The other way of revealing formulas is to use the menu, and obviously this is Excel 2003, and here we go to the tools menu, come down to options, and here just make sure you have the view tab selected, and down at the bottom of the view tab you'll see window options, and all you do is just make sure there's a little check in the formulas option, click OK and that does the same thing as the keyboard shortcut. If you use the menu to reveal the formulas you can use the keyboard shortcut to hide them again so I can now do control and spare and that will revert the spreadsheet. Okay so I hope that will come in useful for you. One last thing I'm going to do here is click into cell F2 and I've added something onto the spreadsheet I've been using for my earlier tutorials and it's this month to date section here and I'm simply going to press the equals key click on cell D13 which contains my total value for the income and then just press enter and all that is doing is referring to that cell and you'll see why in the next few tutorials because I'm going to start discussing using multiple sheets and multiple workbooks and uh, that will form part of that set of tutorials okay so that's all for now thank you for watching again and I will see you in the next video